Are you with me so far? Others, not sure? <laughs> Others are still evaluating? Well, we do not know, we are with you or not. Okay. So, this we reaches to a point which is called types of research. Now, what is the type of research? Let us talk about that. The research which we talk about in general, that is a descriptive research, but what exactly is the type of research? I am talking about uh, time perspective. In the books, you will find n number of research, but I am talking about the time perspective. The first, when the, the concept is very new, it is called exploratory research. There is no review available. Okay. There is no idea, absolutely no idea, then it call, is called as the exploratory research. If I have a time machine, I will take back to you some 10,000 years or back, people were living in caves, homo sapiens, before that homo sapiens, sapiens something like that, Neanderthals etc. You know that story? People are living in the caves, all they were doing were eating, sleeping, praying, just go for hunt, come, no university, no PhD, what a happy life it was. Is not it? Now, the first person who said, well friends, there is something called time. The person must have beaten at that time. But the person, just think of, there is nothing, you are living in the caves, like one doggy say to another doggy, what is the time? The doggies are never concerned about the times, we human beings are. But the first person who said, there is a time, then they said, there is something called a day and a night and a year year first, month and the days later on, that was adjusted little bit. What exactly it is? It is a research, exploratory research. Nobody worked on that area so far. Just think of the first person who said, well, I am in stress. Have you uh, ever seen a stressed doggy or stressed cat? Have you seen that? Well, she is just worrying about, you know, the things are not going okay. I am not finding enough mice these days. There is no stress, but the human beings, the, somebody might have said it, somebody might have said it sometime, just like uh, somebody said uh, a term, there is a hepatitis A, hepatitis B, there is a AIDS, there was a first patient, there is always, right, and in every season, there is a first patient of malaria, chikungunya, something like that. That is what I am saying, exploratory research, when no review is available. The first question comes, when no review is available, how you come to know? Okay, so, maybe fiction, maybe fiction or maybe the real life in a scenario, maybe the fiction, maybe the real life scenario, when the Louis Pasteur said, oh sorry, not the Louis Pasteur, when Louis Pasteur said that whatever the disease is there, the cure is inside it, inside every disease there is something antibody which fights through that and he said I should make a particular serum, people did not believe him. He said, okay, let me experiment on me and my son and he successfully shown that. So, there was some sort of maybe the real life scenario, maybe some sort of fiction, maybe some idea, let us do that way, that is the thing. So, review, review should not be taken as uh, the books etcetera or the thesis or the newspaper, review is anybody knowing about that. Precisely, see books are one way of preserving the knowledge, not more than that. Real knowledge is a human beings, which we pass from generation to generation, that is the knowledge. So, one is the exploratory research, when it is like stress, when it is successfully handled over the years, we call it as descriptive research. We have the models about it, we have the theories about it. Now, just two days back, I was in Chandigarh and one scholar asks, sir, what exactly is a model? Because my guide says, which model you will use and then I come back every time. So, what exactly is the model? Model is nothing but the interplay of the variables. How the variables are related, that is a model, it is not as something like rocket science, like stress. Gender has an effect on stress and stress affects the performance. Do you agree with it? Gender has an effect on stress? <laughs> what exactly I have written? <laughs> like what? Uh, we can say it like this, gender is related with the stress, maybe girls are more in stress or boys are more in stress and then stress has an effect on the performance, this is my model. Or I wish to check, I wish to check that stress affects performance, whether the effect for boys and girls same in both, 
do you understand whether the effect of stress on performance for boys and girls same or not can you tell me how many variables are there in my study like for example if i'll go to the people just like the same way i will go to the people what should i seek which information i should seek like i go to him i will ask stress are you stressed or not or something like stress i will look for the performance and shall i look for gender or not so there are the three variables there are the three variables now in the three variables can i take out the gender out of the person can i make it a fix if i'll make it a fix only for the girls only for the boys then this study will be stress leads to performance for girls separately for boys separately but if i wish to compare then i have to take gender also into consideration right now this relationship so it's no longer a control variable are you clear between the control variable and the other things control variable is we make it constant so it's not a control variable it's a third variable here it will be called as moderator moderating variable a moderating variable is a relationship of particular categories let me give another example if you find quality good then you are happy and if you are happy you may go for repurchase or rebuy does it sound okay if there is a quality you go to a restaurant there is a quality you feel very happy if you are happy you may go again now quality leads to satisfaction satisfaction leads to rebuy it means this is a mediator mediator is something a leads to b b leads to c so can you see any difference between this and this in this example am i saying stress leads to gender actually the stress that tells me it's a boy or girl or stress makes boy and girl and boy and girl makes the performance no doesn't make sense okay so it simply says whether the stress to performance is affected by is this, is it same for the boy and the girl what is the difference between these two three variables here three variable here it's a dependent independent and here actually this is both for here it's a dependent it's a dependent variable for this it's a independent for this so when a variable is simultaneously dependent and independent it's called mediator when a variable is simultaneously independent and dependent both two roles it becomes mediator you know mediator is something like uh, assistant manager deputy manager and the manager assistant manager sign something it goes to the deputy manager signs and then it goes to this in the hierarchy but this one is not in the hierarchy it simply says this relationship for this category or this category so it's a moderator it's a mediator and a control variable so am i clear about the nomenclature little bit not entirely little bit idea so so far with me hmm. take an example advertisement leads to sales more advertisement more sales vice versa so whether this relationship established same in delhi and agra maybe or may not be so this is third variable called as the place this is the third variable called the place so am i saying advertisement leads to place and place leads to sales no what i am doing whether a relationship is same for the two state, states two countries two cities so that's called as a if it is a control variable what i will say no no this is if different i will make a study only of delhi how many variables are there now Three. two because the study is only for the delhi study is only for the delhi so there are only two variables okay i got it first we will talk about the objective wise analysis because it should be more clear to you but let me just complete this briefly and then i will go for the next i will come back to this uh, again mediator and the moderator a simple thing you can understand a relation between two categories that's moderator and a leads to b b leads to c when a variable is simultaneously dependent and independent that's a mediator moderator is a relation for two categories comparing for the two that's called a moderator